Hey, yo, what's poppin'? It's J to the A, D to the A. Welcome to my little corner of heaven. How y'all doing today? Today, we get into ancestor messages, question mark, and no cap, no cap, no cap, no cap. I feel like this is a love reading. I feel it. I feel like this is a love reading. I don't know. I was looking at some of the cards, like, you know, of course, while I'm shuffling, some of them uh, flop over and stuff like that and some of y'all are avoiding love readings and guess what i'm the one because i don't do love readings like that but guess what i'm the one for you come on sit down sit down give me some of your time baby give me some of your time because i'm about to blow your mind baby you feel me and a lot of people spirit guys are coming in outside of them being just ancestors is what i felt um I felt some like marine energy, some serpent energy, and we'll get to it. And I feel like that's ironic because I didn't feel the water spirits until after I switched around some things. Okay, we gonna get into it. Anyway, pound number one is some nail polish. The color is called Deep Dive. Pound number two is a Band-Aid, and pound number three is... <laughs> I'm sorry, I started laughing because, you know, like, I don't discriminate against lighters, but this is a crack lighter, you feel what I'm saying? <laughs> it's not a crack lighter because it's not super turned up, but, you know, you call these type of lighters crack lighters. Let me get some water. Ooh, okay. These type of lighters is like crack lighters, and, you know, people be wanting a big because you can stand outside and the big flame ain't gonna go away if the wind blowing type shit, all that other shit. So, yeah, we got this blue lighter that I just be using to light shit. Like, <laughs> I don't do crack. <laughs> okay. <laughs> crack is like. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, pause the video if you need to. Take a deep breath. Excel. Just so you know, I do $20 tarot card reads for 20 minutes. Anything after $20 a minute. Minimum is a dollar a minute. It's a dollar a minute. Ayy. Huh? Huh? Ayy. Come on. We're going to show this A. I also offer bone charm and oracle card readings. Anybody from around the world can order this for me. But if you want a physical item from my shop, you must be in the USA or USA territory. Make sure you like, 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 comment, 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 share, 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 and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Let's get into it. Ayo, what's popping pound number one? I'm very excited for this pile because this nail polish kept rolling over. It kept rolling over so much that I had to put tape on it so it won't roll over. And it's called Deep Dive. All right. I know you're probably like, why is my ancestors telling me about such and such? Now, I told y'all I felt like every pile was dealing with love. And as we see, not even as we see, you finna see, you finna hear that as of power one, I was correct. So, y'all are either coming into like this abundance or y'all coming into this energy of being able to wed. Yo, I swear to God, spirits is fucking out with me right now because that's not even what I was finna say. Whoa, <laughs> my heart started beating fast. Sometimes I get a little nervous because sometimes I, I, I like I still got to get used to it at times. But um, y'all are coming into like some stability. You feel what I'm saying? Y'all may be moving into a new home. Y'all may be traveling and stuff like that. And you are being warned to get a grip on your emotions. Get some emotional stability conjure shit type in emotions in my website and you'll see what type of talismans work with that and help with that emotional stability is very very important for you emotional wellness is very very important for you i started offering bay leaf conjure services for 33 dollars for 33 bay leaves okay and they will all be channeled for but i'm here to tell you you are coming upon divine romantic union, okay? And you need to get your emotions under control. Nothing is wrong with being emotional, but when your emotions are overflowing from a traumatic place, from past heartbreaks, it could put negative energy onto your partner and, you know, your partner don't deserve that, 
okay so work on your own healing within yourself shit come get a reading and we'll see what else you need because this may be stemming from you know some type of sexual trauma being bullied you know being uh in a commitment with somebody that you trusted and having them betray you all right so i'm not here to beat you over the head and be like snap out of it motherfucker like yes snap out of it but also give yourself some compassion give yourself some consideration give yourself yes honesty but you're someone that's not on no stupid fuck shit in these moments y'all are genuinely trying and you just need to try a little harder and take a different approach okay some of y'all this y'all first time realizing this but just know i have open arms for you open hands for you and the most high in your ancestors got open arms and open hands for you as well some of y'all are working with oshun some of y'all are working with mommy wata or one of her aspects santa mata la dominadora la siren filamino lubana Yamaya, you feel what I'm saying? Y'all are working with certain energies and they're here, okay? I work with these energies. They're here speaking through me, telling you to come to them and ask them, woo, the way the emotions just cloaked me, to ask them to help you, to ask them to help you with your emotions and the emotions that flow within you great emotions and not so great emotions they will help you with it i know i asked for that i know i asked motherfucking uh olokun and yamaya you feel me yamoja you feel me i asked both of them <laughs> to help me with my emotions and i also asked oshun in a way to help me get over the negative aspects of my emotion y'all need to check out this video you'll fuck with it all right congratulations on your divine union just so you know i do 20 dollars tarot card reads for 20 minutes anything after 20 dollars minimum is a dollar a minute it's a dollar a minute hey huh huh hey come on we're good on shoulders. A, I also offer Bone Charm and Oracle Card readings. Anybody from around the world can order those things for me. But if you want a physical item from my shop, you must be in the USA or USA territory. Make sure you like, 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 comment, 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 share, 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 and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Peace, my G. Ayo, what's popping power number two? Y'all finna be mad. Y'all finna be mad because y'all is somebody that got you somebody good in your life. You feel me? And take what resonates. This could be for you or this could be about your partner. If this is about your partner, this is what you need to tell them. But I'm going to talk about it like I'm speaking, you know, to the viewer. And this is about the viewer. <sighs> Woo, I'm a little nervous. <laughs> but you chose the band-aid and the most high gave you a stable relationship. If you're that unhappy, just leave. I must tell y'all right now that people who pick this power, come get a you know a personal reading but generally speaking this is your person like this is the love of your life why the fuck y'all arguing so much like like y'all arguing over nothing or y'all arguing over things that can be discussed in a civil manner people be looking at me like i got a whole bunch of fucking mouth and people be looking at me like i'm combative and shit but really i just be talking and people be getting upset and then they be raising a voice or getting combative with me and then i match the energy and all of a sudden i'm the villain it's like no nigga i try to talk to you like this and then you got you know your panties or your boxers in a twist you feel me your briefs and a wide you feel me <laughs> okay your bloomers in a knot you feel what i'm saying so you need to really take this message and discuss it with your partner like where do we go from here what are we doing and where do we go from here and attempt to change your communication style right or get a talking stick like the relationship with my mom is currently a failure don't get me wrong i do not fucking talk to that bitch but <laughs> i you know made something up i think i grabbed something randomly out the kitchen i was like okay when i have this i talk and when you have this you can talk so i gave her the talking stick and let her talk and then she'll give it back and then i'll say what i need to say um you know you might think that's stupid but attempt i'm not saying it's gonna be right 
the first time it was gonna be like oh it was perfect uh, immediately but it's about the effort y'all are meant for each other y'all are literally handcrafted for each other get the fuck over it and move forward me saying get the fuck over it and move forward i'm not saying this stuff that you want to discuss don't matter but when you mad at somebody and when you feel like the communication failed the first time then y'all start beefing yes you know the the actual argument may have been over something giant but y'all still didn't communicate properly and y'all still not on the same page so every other thing that this person does either one of y'all gonna view it fucking negatively for example oh my god for example i walked out of certain conversations with you know that's my goal is to walk out of certain conversations with freedom Hell nah, motherfuckers have had a chip on their shoulder all day long and it's just adding on the chips because now they looking at you like they don't fuck with you. Nigga, you will fuck around, roll over, and the way your partner breathe irritates you, okay? So make sure you're trying to get on the right page. People think I'm motherfucking stupid. People think I'm combative. People think me having conversations is disrespectful. They think I just need to bow my head and be like, yes, master. Like, no, nigga, we can have an adult conversation and move past this or not. And we can just choose to not be in each other's lives, period. Just so you know, off of $20 hair coffee is 20 minutes. Anything after $20 a minute, minimum is a dollar a minute. It's a dollar a minute. Hey, huh? Huh? Hey, come on. We're gonna show this. Hey, I also offer bone trauma oracle card readings. Anybody from around the world can order those things for me. But if you want a physical item from my shop, you must be in the USA or USA territory. Make sure you like, 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 comment, 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 share, 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 and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Peace, power number two. Ayo, hey, what's poppin' pal number three? Pal number three. I told y'all all these pals gonna be about love. Crazy, right? Crazy, right? So, y'all are selfish lovers, bruh. Some of y'all might be Scorpios. Okay, I'm getting a bit of Leo energy, but y'all do not understand that it takes two. Okay, it takes two. Okay, it takes two. A lot of y'all have been brainwashed that on either side i don't give a fuck what the fuck your gender is or what the fuck your gender ideology might be y'all have been brainwashed by heteronormative stereotypes that oh my woman gonna do this 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 oh my man finna do this 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 or oh you might want your partner to have a toxic behavior and you're mad because they don't like People get mad when I'm not jealous. Like They'll try to make me jealous. <laughs> but I hate being jealous. And if I have a tinge of jealousy, I'll like go within and analyze it and take care of it before something that's like resting or ongoing. Because I don't know, I'm just not a jealous person. You feel what I'm saying? It's fucking weird being jealous. <laughs> like if I'm ever jealous, I, I treat that shit, excuse me, I treat that shit like, I got a cut and it's dirt all in the cut. That's exactly how I treat it. I'd be like, oh no, we got to wash this out. We got to put some, <laughs> we got to put some ointment on this. Mm -mm, no, uh, what a peroxide. That's how I treat being jealous. You feel me? You may be mad that your partner don't like yoke you up or yell at you or something like that. You need to grow up. Okay. You need to grow up. You might be like, comparing your relationships to other people's relationships that's probably online mostly but these comparisons are superficial like oh hmm, my boyfriend didn't spend a thousand dollars with me for the holidays um mm, my girlfriend like she didn't like delete all of the guys of her social media like Hmm, I wonder why she did that or no, I'm going to take her phone and I'm just going to clear out her entire follower account. Like I get that to an extent if it's super problematic, but look at look through the messages and then make that decision. Don't just be like, oh, she following Gregory 120. Oh, yeah, I'm going to unfollow and block him and don't even know like he's gay. <laughs> And she was good friends with him in high school. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't go overboard. Uh, be, bro, have some fucking compassion. Have some fucking decency and be kind. Like, it's okay to stand in your power as God, goddess, king, queen, leader, 
you know, emperor, empress, etc., etc., etc. But motherfucker, do not fucking be a selfish lover. I hate that shit. You need to give love too. Why the fuck do you feel like that? I feel like a lot of y'all are brainwashed. Whew, y'all ancestors, man. I feel like a lot of y'all are brainwashed. And it's based on superficiality. Stop watching fucking podcasts and go pray about your fucking relationship. <laughs> Don't be like, oh, I have a question. Let me type it into YouTube and watch some ra random, excuse me, watch some random person that's probably not even in a relationship, probably don't even love themselves and they just acting for the camera or probably just spewing hate because them themselves, they grew up without having, you know, the female or male gaze. So they're spewing a whole bunch of low vibrational remedies or low vibrational ideology that helps them feel better about themselves. You feel what I'm saying? Or that motivated them to enter or master superficial areas concepts etc 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 in and of their lives like bro come on stop i don't give a fuck if y'all be mad unscribe i don't give a damn the real niggas gonna like this shit and be like damn that hit she just read the fuck out of me my ancestors just read the fuck out of me yeah stop that shit is fucking bogus and shit stop it please okay <laughs> damn just so you know, I do twenty dollars tarot card reads for twenty minutes. Anything after twenty dollars a minute minimum is a dollar a minute. It's a dollar a minute. Hey, huh, huh? Hey, come on, Google them shoulders. Hey, I also offer bone charm oracle card readings. Anybody from around the world can order this thing for me. But if you want a physical item from my shop, you must be in the USA or USA territory. Make sure you like, 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 comment, 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 share, 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 and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Peace, my G. Damn and great luck, cause goddamn.